polymorphic DNA can be detected in the absence of sequence information. कि हमें किसी DNA के sequence की information नहीं होती, even then we can uh, map the DNA. For example, here we can use the technique which is called as PCR in order to amplify the particular uh, genomic DNA. And uh, in first instance, we can uh, cannot uh, uh, use STS sequences. Like STS sequences are are, uh, are sequence tag sites. Uh, they are mainly uh, used to map the DNA. But here, uh, if uh, such sequences like STS are not even known, we can amplify the uh, DNA segment. And here, uh, if you remember, we can develop arbitrary primer. Um, I hope ke aapko yaad hoga a rapid ki technique that is rapid, random amplified polymorphic uh, DNA. Hum arbitrary primer develop karte hain jinka jo sequence length hai it may be uh, around uh, 10 nucleotide base pairs aur isme jo GC content uh, manage kiya jata hai it may uh, ranges from 50 to 80 percent. Another constraints that uh, we can take into consideration uh, while developing primer for rapid uh, is that uh, there should be no uh, palindromic sequences in the primer. Palindrome means if the sequence they are reading the same that is in 5 prime to 3 prime direction they are the same like 5 prime to 3 prime they may be adenine they may be guanine uh, and so on and same is uh, is for uh, uh, adenine thymine etc so they should not be read same in 5 prime to 3 prime direction jaise maine kaha ki agar koi cheez likhi hui hai a b c d hai to dusri 5 prime se wo a b c d ki tarah uh, uske sequence na ho uh, so it will prevent the self uh, complementation between the primers. Rapid technique is uh, very valuable for the mapping of uh, uh, genome of uh, plants because it provides wide range of uh, uh, DNA markers uh, so that we can know the location of different uh, genes. But there are still certain limitations of the use of rapid technique. Although it is valuable, uh, in the absence of sequence information. The limitation is that uh, reaction mixture can influence the result. The template concentration kitni hai, dusra solutions kitni hai, uh, a group ke result o raenge kisi o research group ke result uh, variable ho sakte hai. And in the same way, uh, a core limitation hai ke uh, heterozygotes jo hai, unko hum detect nahi kar sakte parents they are difficult to detect. Because of uh, these limitations, a modification has been developed where we can use STS sequences. Now we have to select DNA segment select DNA segment which is sequence known. Ho. So this is one of the variations uh, where we can use STS sequences so that we can develop site specific primer if primer they are available then we can specifically amplify the target dna sequence aur jab hamare paas amplified fragments aate hain inko purify kiya jata hai and then they can be uh, digested with a set of restriction endonucleases or uh, digestion ke baad we can resolve them on the gel because here we are going to use amplified DNA fragments and then they are digested, then they are commonly called as the caps, that is, a cleaved amplified polymorphic uh, sequences are caps. Now, the, these sequences they are very helpful even to differentiate the heterozygote. Suppose here we have uh, three type of uh, sequences. It is suppose one parent having this uh, homozygous situation A, A and B, B for another parent and offspring may be A, B. First is it is having two restriction 
side so that the fragments can be dissolved on the gel after amplification and uh, then in case of another BB here three restriction sites are present and we can dissolve four DNA fragments and and in case of heterozygote like a B the genes of two parents can be represented here for example the dark bands indicates that uh, they belongs to parents like here this band and this band it is represented one dark band in the heterozygote and then second is here and in this way by using STS sequences we can even differentiate some heterozygotes